Weddle builds my team. Listen, I was thinking of doing this video and I thought to myself, wow, Matt, what a banger original video idea. You'll go into Weddle play and if you get a player right, you can add them to your Madden team and then go play a game with it. Turns out, not only am I not original, creative, funny, handsome L plus ratio, two people have already done this at the least. There might even be more. Number one, Vic. Literally the day I'm recording this, someone just told me, Vic has a video on this. So you guys know I love Vic. I guarantee that video is a banger. So after this, check his out. Number two, Two, Kenny Beecham, absolute stud as well, has done this for 2K. So basically, I'm an unoriginal cuck, but this video will be a banger. So once you're done with this video, if you loved it, there's two more that you can watch. So I wanted to shout out those two guys. I'm late to the party, apparently, but it's still a party. I may be late to the party, but it's still a party. The premise is simple. Right now on Ultimate Team, I just have a base squad of a bunch of random players. I'm gonna play Weddle. The way I'm gonna do it is I have 15 attempts on normal mode. Only on the attempts that I actually get correct out of my eight guesses, I can add those players to my team. Hopefully, I go 15 for 15. So for example, if one of the players is AJ Dillon, AJ Dillon has a 99 overall golden ticket halfback. I can go in the store, buy his 99 overall golden ticket, and add it to my team. So yes, perfect example. If AJ Dillon was the player, I guessed it correctly. I can add this gold 99, golden ticket, six foot, 247 pound monster. And if I get stuff wrong, then I will be punished by not being able to build the best possible team. You guys get the idea. You guys know how well it works. If you somehow don't, you're about to learn very quick. So let's hop right in. I'll start out my guess with AJ Green. Nothing is correct except for the NFC East, but it's not an Eagle. Why don't we just go with Ezekiel Elliott next? It's not Dallas, it's not Philly. Also, I'm just spamming out my guesses because I know I'm gonna get these right. So I'm not too worried. Daniel Jones next. Our player is absolutely a Washington commander and they're over six foot five. So it's a really tall Washington commander who's not a wide receiver. Is it Logan Thomas? Logan Thomas. Wait, does Logan Thomas have a good card? All right, well, we got a tight end at the very least, which is good because you guys know I use my tight ends a lot, but I have no idea what Logan Thomas has this year. Dude, he doesn't have shit. Who are you? Wait, is this is this Logan Thomas? The, he was a quarterback, wasn't he? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I just got, wow, I'm such a casual. I guess technically right now, I just got a tight end or a quarterback. If I don't get another quarterback that actually is gonna be so clutch, I imagine I'll probably get another quarterback. For now, I'm using him as a tight end. It's not very good, it's an 85. And in case I don't get a quarterback, I guess I have Logan Thomas. All right, let's just start off with Anthony Schwartz, and it's actually a really good guess. It is a wide receiver, so we're getting a wide receiver no matter what. AFC wide receiver number 11 or 12. I'm not going to worry about jersey number because I'm not very good at that. I'm just going to try and figure out division. So it's not AFC North. I'm typing in Tannehill just so I can get AFC South. Oh, shit. It's a big-ass wide receiver in the AFC South. A six foot four wide receiver. It could be Pittman, right? Bingo. Dude, he doesn't have shit. Wait, did he get a golden ticket? Oh, dude, I don't think his golden ticket came out yet. Oh! Oh, Pittman has a golden ticket, and I don't think it came out yet. He's still has a decent wide receiver card. 92 overall Michael Pittman. That sucks. Oh, that sucks. He literally has a golden ticket. Damn. Start with Aaron Jones. Ooh, I'm gonna need a running back too. So this is not a running back. It is a, no ooh, we get another wide receiver. Six footer, six foot one. Let's hope that this one's better. It's an AFC wide receiver. Let's just start with Chase Claypool. AFC North. 25 year old wide receiver. Let's go Mike Evans. I think he's a little older than 25. Oh, it's NFC. I'm an idiot. Ooh, bad guess. I thought, why did I think that was AFC? What about Michael Thomas? Wait, I'm such an idiot. What am I doing? That's also the, I just had a complete aneurysm. Not the AFC East, not the AFC North. So it's the AFC South or the AFC West. Let's go Brandon Cooks. It's an AFC South wide receiver. And I have one guess left. Shit. It better not be someone good. I just wasted so many guesses. I am completely fine. I wasted a bunch of guesses, but I was never gonna get that anyway. There's no shot he has a good card in Madden. Literally, he doesn't even have a card on the auction house in Mad right now. That was Weddle normal mode? Damn, I just got clapped. All right, hey, that's one that counts though. That totally counts. All right, let's start with AJ Brown again. Not a wide receiver. Oh, I'm praying this is a running back. Yes, yes. We've got an AFC running back. Give me Najee Harris, come on. Not the AFC North. Okay, what about James Robinson? Not the AFC South. AFC East or West, once again. What about Zach Moss? Ooh, it's an AFC East running back. Kinda hoping it's like Miles Gaskin. Oh, look at how close that is. Holy 
shit. That was damn near it. Well, let's just try Patriots and then I'll figure it out. Who are the running backs? They still have Sony. No, they don't have Sony Michelle. He's on the Rams. Damian Harris, right? This is fantasy football talking now. Okay, Damian Harris. I don't, I'm not getting very good shit right now. I'm not even gonna lie. We gotta start heating up because Damian Harris is not gonna have anything nice. I don't think. Oh, okay. He got something. He got a combine card. At the very least, we have a 94 overall Damian Harris. He's not very good though. I'm not even gonna lie. He's kind of ass. So we're hoping we can get something better than that. All right, so that was our fourth round. This is our fifth now. I would very much like a quarterback that's better. It's not a quarterback, but it is. Might be a wide receiver. Oh, running back again, let's go. Let's just take another whack at running back. Ooh, 27 year old running back in the NFC, Dalvin Cook, please tell me it's, oh, it can't be, cause it's not NFC North. So it can't be Dalvin Cook. Darn it, I just really wanted it to be. What about Leonard Fournette? Couldn't be Leonard Fournette? Not the NFC South, not the NFC North. What about Zeke? NFC East, okay, so it's the NFC West. Sony Michelle? It is not Sony Michelle. Wait, he's on Miami? Whoa! When did he get on Miami? Okay, but our player is 5'11". Oh, I'm six of eight guesses. You gotta be a little more careful. What about James Conner? It's not James Conner. I only have one guess left. I think it's Chris Carson, but if it's Chris Carson, that also sucks. If it's Chris Carson, this kind of blows because he's not very good. It's fucking Chris Carson. Damn it! Dude, we're gonna clap. There's so many good running backs in this game. And honestly, like Chris Carson is a really well-known running back and so is Damian Harris. They just don't have good Madden cards. This is Chris Carson's best card in 82. I'm not even buying it. That's so poverty. Oh, we really gotta heat up now, boys. Not a wide receiver. Come on, give me another running back, baby. Not a running back. It's a quarterback. It's a quarterback in the AFC who is five foot eleven. That's how's Lamar. Okay, not Lamar. What about Russell Wilson? Is this Russell Wilson? Hey, wait, <gasps> that's so goaded. Wait, he has that insane card. Oh, yes, finally. All right, that's huge. Russell Wilson, dude, he's crap. This whole year, he's had an insane card. The 98 overall improviser, Russell Wilson. Beast. He's an, he's an in-game quarterback. We just got him. He's going to be complimented by Damian Harris and Logan Thomas and Michael Pittman, which is ugly, but we still got a lot more guesses to keep going here, so let's keep cranking. Russell Wilson, that's huge. All right, give me a wide receiver. Holy shit, it's an eagle. No, don't let it be Jalen Hurts now. Please, just don't be Jalen Hurts. Thank God, it's not Jalen Hurts. Oh, thank God. So it's not a wide receiver or quarterback. Is it Dallas Goddard? Yes! I love Dallas Goddard. I love Dallas Goddard. I don't think, actually, he might actually, he might have like a 96. He has something in this, I swear. Whatever, low key, a 90 overall tight end, so much better than the 85 Logan Thomas. We'll gladly take Dallas Goddard. Let's go. Nice guess to start out. AJ Brown's always my first guess. So it's an NFC non-wide receiver. Let's just do Dallas Goddard, see if it's a tight end again. It's not a tight end. Ooh, I think it's a quarterback. I think we got another quarterback here. Let's go Jared Goff. But oh, it is an NFC North quarterback. Is it Aaron Rodgers? That is Kirk Cousins, who is poverty. Oh no, sorry Kirk, I'm not even. Listen, I want to mention to say, Kirk, I do love you, thanks for that Rose Bowl dub, but no, never, no, never, it's not happening, no. Okay, we have a 24 year old player on this next one. In the NFC, not a wide receiver. We might have a quarterback again. We can't really improve quarterback, so that is kind of a bummer. I'm gonna guess Tom Brady. It is a quarterback. It's not the NFC South, leaves the NFC West. It might be Kyler. It is Kyler, damn! Kyler would have been nice. If I didn't already have Russell, Kyler would be nice. Yeah, bro, he's, oh, he does have a gold 99. I did not realize he had a gold 99 limited. Actually a sick card. Statistically, this Kyler Murray is actually a better card. Like he has better stats, but he's a scrambler QB and improvisers are just a million times better for abilities unless I was gonna run escape artist, which I'm not gonna run escape artist. So Russell Wilson is still the better pick here. Wide receiver, please, yes! Let's go, NFC wide receiver, not Philly. So not the NFC East. Maybe this takes us over to the NFC North. It does, holy shit it does. 25 year old in the NFC North. Slow, taller than 6'4". Doesn't play for the Lions, Bears. Who's Bears? I can't imagine the Bears have anybody bigger. Vikings have Justin Jefferson. This is absolutely a Packer. Is it Alan Lazard? It's not Alan Lazard? Okay, I'm gonna say Justin Jefferson just to narrow out the last team, which is the Bears. The Bears have a wide receiver who's 6'5"? Did they pick somebody up that I'm not aware of? I have to take an L here, dude. If this is a God tier wide receiver, I'm gonna be pissed, but I'm just gonna throw out random guesses until they tell me. Equinamius St. Brown, oh, okay. I did forget about him because we have we have Amonra St. Brown, which is his brother. I actually thought Equinamius St. Brown was on the Packers. They must've got him from the Packers or I'm just a casual. He has a 68 overall, so I'm okay with the L there. It's AFC West, they're 6'6", six, six. it's a tight end. It's a tight end in the AFC, not AFC West, my bad. West, North, so what's AFC South? 
What about Wanu Smith? It's AFC East tight end. Oh, please tell me it's Dawkins. Dawson Knox, not Dawkins, Dawson Knox, come on. Oh no, it's not Dawson Knox, but they are number 88, jeez. So it's either a Jet tight end, which I don't even think those are real. Do those exist? Do the Jets have players on their team? So it has to be a Dolphin. Oh, Gasicki. Yes! Oh, Gasicki! I fucking love Mike Gasicki. He has to have better than a 90. This is the best Mike Gasicki card? That's a crime. Or does it just not exist on the auction house right now? Gasicki's got a 97 overall. He has a 97, but it's not on the auction house. That blows. There's nobody people hoarding Mike Gasicki? <gasps> oh! He just jumped! He just fucking jumped! Boy, that shit! Hey! <laughs> What the fuck? Oh my god. That's some that's some YouTube timing right there. Let's go, baby. Okay, so we got a 97 Gasicki and back and hang him up is Dallas Goddard. We played 10 games. I've got five left to find myself a really good wide receiver, really good hatback. I think that's gonna help this team a lot. It is a wide receiver, boys. It's not the NFC, it's in the AFC. I'm just gonna say Rashad Bateman just to get AFC North. Okay. I'm gonna say Pittman. It's an AFC South wide receiver who is six foot two. And they're significantly older than 24. This is a, this is an established guy. Darn it, I don't think they're gonna be good. None of those teams have good wide receivers. They just don't. What about Cooks? Let's just see if it's the Texans. It's a Texans wide receiver. There's no way. Who could that even be? Is Chris Conley on the, oh jeez. Okay, I mean, I'm happy to have it. Just no shot Chris Conley has a good card, right? He's got a 92 overall. Okay, Chris Conley, whatever, whatever. Running back, running back, running back, running back. 5'10 or 5'11 running back in the AFC. Give me Jonathan Taylor. Oh! Fucking love Jonathan Taylor. All right, Russell Wilson and Jonathan Taylor in the backfield. 97 overall Jonathan Taylor. If you guys have seen my Colts theme team video, you would know he's a, just a, a actual monster. He's literally so good. So we have three Weddles left to basically just get a really good wide receiver. That's what's gonna close this team out. Oh my God, we have a shot right now. We have a shot right now. It is a wide receiver. NFC, not NFC East. They're shorter than 6'1". Six, six foot wide receiver, not NFC North. Let's go to Chris Godwin for the NFC South. It is the NFC South. It's not Chris Godwin. The Panthers. Oh, is it more? Is it DJ Moore? Wait, 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 wait. Dude, he's such a beast. He's one of the few highlights of that Panthers offense right now, especially when McCaffrey always goes down. Please tell me he has a good card. 94 DJ Moore. It is our best wide receiver right now. He's not a god, but he's our best wide receiver right now. Happy to have him. It's Russell Wilson, Jonathan Taylor, Mike Kosicki, DJ Moore. We still have two guesses. If these are wide receivers, honestly, I don't even care. Oh my God, let's go. Dude, You the amount of wide receivers I'm getting. They have, somebody has it really good, right? Let's put our thinking caps together here. AFC. I'm gonna do Pittman. I'm praying it's not the AFC. Why is it always the AFC South? All their wide receivers suck. Unless it's Brandon Cooks. Unless it's Brandon Cooks. Yes! <laughs> fucking good wide receiver that old bitch. Let's go. I think he has like a 98 or a 99. He's got a nasty card. Oh, it's a 95? Really? It's a 95? He's a beast and he's fast as shit. Brandon Cooks, thank you for existing. We're making our wide receivers better and our five Final, our final player is a wide receiver up again. What is going on? Another wide receiver, please. Dude, sauce me up, give me a 99. This actually is bad news, unless it's DJ Chark. No, DJ Chark's number 25, so it's not DJ Chark. But it is a Detroit wide receiver? Wait a second, who do we have? It's not a Monterey St. Brown. It's not DJ Chark. It's a wide receiver for the Lions. It's gonna be someone really poverty. Okay, so we have Jamison Williams from the draft. He's like 21 or 22. We have a Monterey St. Brown, who this is definitely not. I think we have Josh Reynolds, but Josh Reynolds is probably gonna have like a silver. Is it really Josh Reynolds? Josh Reynolds is my final, whatever. I'm just glad I got Brandon Cooks and DJ Moore back to back. Out of pure poverty for the Detroit Lions, out of my fandom, I will look up Josh Reynolds. There's no shot, he has a good card. 75 overall and he's still in a Titans practice uniform. Okay, I could get him at a bargain though for 650 coins. That's it. As you can tell, Weddle normal mode only has offensive players. You know what? No, fuck it. I make the rules. I make the rules. I'm gonna keep going until I get someone insane. I don't give a shit. I'm just gonna cheat this until I get a wide receiver. That's not a wide receiver, so we're just gonna spam guess this. Eventually. Yes! <laughs> Receiver. Finally! Finally! All right, yeah, I know there were rules. I know there were rules in place. I just want everyone to know that I don't care. If there's one thing that I learned in my life, it's, it's cheat. Cheat on everything. Cheat on exams. Cheat on your girlfriend. Cheat on everything. Yeah! 
All right, now keep in mind, obviously there's no offensive lineman on Weddle, so this is what my offensive line looks like. Bunch of randoms that were just on my team. But we've got Mike Isiki, DJ Moore, Russell Wilson, Jonathan Taylor, Brandon Cooks, and Diggs, all from Weddle, and of course, Zonklers, just because he's Zonklers. You gotta have him. Our team is ready to go. Defense, my defense is kind of mediocre. Not shit, but it's mediocre. It's a lot of players you guys see in Wheel of Mott, so Sean Taylor, Isaiah Simmons. I think that's fair. I don't want my defense to be crazy good in a video where I can only build my offense. You know what I mean? Oh, and we have tons of fun jerseys now. I kind of forgot. We have tons of fun jerseys now because of training variety packs. Let's throw something on. I'm going to go with these Broncos. That's kind of a throwback. I used to use these unis in like Madden 2019 or some shit like that. So we're going to go with those. And since there's no Wheel of Mutt season, I can actually play a head-to-head -head game with this team. We're a 94 overall with a 95 offense and a 93 defense. I think that's perfect for the video we're doing, to have a better offense and defense. Ramsey, Sean Taylor, and Russell Wilson did make the top three. She can't shit on me. Let's see what he's got. Frats, oh, it's a... I was literally about to freak out and say it's a Lions theme team. I don't think it is. He might have Lions chem, but JC Horn kind of ruined it. There's one key to winning this game, and it's Jonathan Taylor. This is how... Okay, I don't know what just happened because I felt like I was supposed to run through that hole. But the key to winning this game is Jonathan Taylor. Let's try and secure this edge. Great juke butts, juke. Good shit, Jonathan Taylor. You will be how we win this game. I think he expects the stretch, so we're going right up the middle. Get through it, let's go. Another great juke. There's Gasicki in a window. One hand snag. My boy, Russell Wilson, great ball. We'll move away from, oh, that sucked really bad. Gasicki, I need you. I-N-T, Brian Dawkins. Ooh, I like how we attacked that right there. He's still got good yards, but I like that. Oh, throw it, throw it! What are you doing? Oh, I baited the shit out of Wait, stop and go, Bo Jackson. Yes, sir. Beautiful yards. I needed the reset. I got the reset. Right there, Jonathan Taylor, right across the middle. The jukebox hits. And we're moving down to the 26. We do have an interception with Russ, but I feel good right now. I said there's a key to winning this game. That key is Jonathan Taylor. We're sticking with him. Let's go. Great blocks from Zonka. Brian Dawkins was coming if Chase Young didn't get me, so it is what it is. Third and six. I'm going to get a double team over here and Taylor across the middle. Taylor, wide open. Great ball. Beauty. Down to the six. Oh shit, Chase Young didn't even get blocked right there. Yikes. Oh, he might have been, but so was Y. Actually, maybe not. Maybe I played that right. Oh, Waller! Waller! Oh, I feel so bad scoring with Waller, but he's so open. Oh, it's Wheel of Mott all over again. Our touchdown goes to Darren Waller, our backup tight end to Mike Kosicki. Here's what I'll say is my excuse. Also, I'm running a fake right now, and it's not gonna fucking work. Come on, kicker! Kicker tackle! Kicker tackle. Ramsey's X Factor activated, all thanks to that. Uh-oh, gotta make a really big play on Bo Jackson. Okay, weird, weird juke. Wow, what a ballsy throw. I can't believe he threw that. He's looking for Bo, I don't think he's gonna be there. Whoa, what a throw. That was Shake Hat back corner, I've seen that before. Same thing, I think, no it's not, it's slightly different. Oh, where are you throwing? <gasps> Wait, what, I didn't lurk that? Oh my God, I thought that was a free lurk. Yes, sir. Oh my God, how did we, what, what, what? Okay, well there's 57 seconds and two timeouts. I still got this. I still got this in the bag. Alrighty, first and 10. Oh, oh, let's go Russ. Let's go Russ, made a man miss. And he's out of bounds, what a play. And there's Jonathan Taylor wide open on the slip screen. Oh, I do not get out of bounds. I'm not gonna call a timeout yet. He gives up on Gesicki, I got Gesicki single coverage. I believe. <laughs> I really believe in that. Darn it. Big! <laughs> what? There's no way Bo Jackson just mossed Jalen Ramsey. I couldn't get Mike Kosicki to get up on Kyle Hamilton. Dude, I'm getting bottled left and right. Chase Young now has three sacks. I'm struggling right now. I'm gonna ask a lot from you, Russ, but let's make it happen. We gotta find a way to win. We can't lose the Weddle game, it's too fun. All right, let's hand it off to Jonathan Taylor. He has been doing solid. Great run right here. Aiden Hutchison gets the tackle, but that's six yards. Let's see how this looks. Ooh, but Jonathan Taylor fights for it. Could have been real bad right there. And there is Jonathan Taylor right when I need him. I, I want there to be time for me to stop him. His offense sucks. He, he mossed me for a touchdown. I'm fine with that. I'll just go Jonathan Taylor again. I'm just gonna keep picking these yards up. Eight for 12, 102. This is a very difficult game, but it's still very winnable. Hit him with a little bit of his own medicine, a little shake hat back corner, see if he likes it. And there's Jonathan Taylor on a beautiful route, and I can't imagine he likes that. Jonathan Taylor's getting tired though, dude. He's working his ass off right now. I think he's in man. I think a sickie's gonna be open. Ada Hutchinson, can you chill out? Damn it, that's my own lion player too. She's killing me. 
There's nothing open. Third and goal. I'm looking for more. If not, I couldn't tell you what I'm looking for. Unless this is man. Let's just see, let's just see. DJ Moore! I need the two point though. Have to get the two point. My pass game is, is kind of ugly right now. That was, that could have gone one of two ways. He wasn't that open. There he is. There he is! Let's go! We still got three timeouts, three minutes, 16 seconds. Let's go, boys. Okay, this was toss. I'm gonna get on two tall Jones and get over to it. There it is. Look at all the, yes, let's go! Perfect stop. Knew what he was gonna do. Does he chew clock here? He might be chewing clock. Oh, he's not, he's not. Shake cap back corner. Seen him run this about a billion times. He wants to go right here. Yes, he does! Yes, he does! Isaiah! Simmons stop and go. Oh, he knows the stop and go. He perfectly played that. Hey, great job. But you know what? We're back on offense already. I say we just get back in the end zone and let him play offense again. I'm going to dive right at him. And Jesus, Ndamukong Sue just chucked my center. Stretch left. Oh my God, Ndamukong Sue. That was so open if he wasn't there. Like I'm really struggling. Oh, but Jonathan Taylor. Do I go for this? I'm going for it. Fourth and one. I'm going read option. Fourth and one. There's the handoff. Daylight and a little more. Let's go. Down to the two, 13 rushes, 51 yards, one more. Actually, no, I'm passing because he's run committing. I can't stop his edge rush. It's insane. Second and goal from the two. I guess I'm just gonna hand it off to Jonathan Taylor. I believe before. Let's go. Carry me. I'm not going for two. I'm going for one. 21 to 14. Oh my God. What a second half so far. Let's keep it up. A minute 33 to clamp and definitely no two point conversions either. Left side's open. Oh, he's going for the heave. Metcalf. Oh shit, wait, you know what? That kind of sucks, but not really at all. I get a minute 22, let's see if he goes for two. He might seal his own fate by going for two right now. Cause if he goes for two and doesn't get it, this game's over. I, I really respect this. Let's see what he wants. This ain't open, none of it's open! You sealed your fate! And there goes Matthew Stafford. I'm sorry to do that to you, Stafford. Oh, don't tell me. Oh my God. I would've had an extra two, but he just sealed his own fate. 21 to 20, he's not gonna onside. That, see, that's fine by me. Score that quick. If he scores with no time left, I'm worried. Certainly, I'm not saying I tried to do that though. He fucking torched me. He's gotta get back on Mike Evans. He knows I'm running the ball. Jonathan Taylor, a solid run. He got two yards there. He's gotta use his timeout. Not a run commit. Good run though. Ooh, sheesh. Dude, he's got like a, he really does have a very good user. The thing that he sucks at though, he sucks at guarding this route out of Jonathan Taylor. Like he's so bad at it. I think Jonathan Taylor's gonna get this and it's game over. He can't, he literally can't guard it. That's game. <laughs> I feel bad throwing that shit on him so much, but he can't guard it. Ooh, what a game. We're gonna win by one. Yeah, all I gotta do is one more snap and that's game. Just can't fumble this. Probably shouldn't be juking with the game on the line like this, but yeah, that's ball game, baby. No, let me see the stats, you cuck. Oh, shit. Oh, I don't even get to see the stats. I love seeing the stats. That was an up and down roller coaster of a game, but we clutched up in the third and fourth quarters. Got us the win. I was down at half. He started with the ball. Got the win, boys. Certainly wasn't pretty, but hey, I'm one and all in this new season. All right, boys, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you really like this video, I kind of want to do it hard mode Weddle. I think I'll have to play like 50 times to even assemble like the shittiest team ever, but it would still be fun. Either way, hey, love you guys. Thanks for watching as always. Uh, that was a banger. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.